Hey guys, Tetsy BG here. I'm um, just going to show you how to make an ILC chart. Not that dissimilar to mine. Um, it's just going to have a file with an exit button and a connect button. So you can just connect and start talking to people on your ILC client. And um, I'd just like to make it very clear that I'm actually not going to be showing you how to make an IRC. I'm going to be showing you how to make an IRC client. Uh, this has nothing to do with actually um, making a IRC like so you can talk to people. It's just a client, so it's an easy view. You can just go from your desktop sort of application. It's nothing to do with actually source coding the IRC details into anything. So don't expect to be making one here. Um, I'm going to be making it with Wild Ride IRC. That's the um, people I've used um, and yeah I made one for Duncan recently so I'm just going to be showing you how I did that one okay um, first what I think you should do is go and look in the description and um, copy the IRC chat dot HTML info just like copy and paste all that stuff um, into a new text document on your um, desktop I prefer like I reckon you should do and then um, go to wild ride I don't know how to do this I've like done it once before but I don't know how to do this anymore I've forgotten um, go to wildride.org and go try and make the channel um, then right here you'll see um, next to php question mark channel equals it'll say duncan on the copy thing um, just change this to your thing uh, your channel's name which I don't know what your channel name is but yeah just change it to that then you're gonna wanna go file save as um, save it as uh, irc.html that's very important that you do the .html or else it won't be a html file it wants me to replace it and I'll just say okay because I didn't actually do anything okay now that's 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 your channel done like you've already made your channel I'm guessing you've just made a HTML file for it so you can access it okay now next um, you're gonna wanna go to and this is in the description too 110mb.com which is uh, 110 megabyte.com it's free web hosting, there's no ads, it's really good and just come here and click this start now button. Uh, once you've registered, which can be a bit of a pain in the neck, they've got a quite tricky but good question they ask you. Uh, I'm not going to tell you the answer or else that would kind of defeat the purpose of them asking you it. But yeah, just go register with them and then um, yeah, click on login and then you'll see there's site management tools for average skill users um, just click on the file manager and then you I've, usually there wouldn't be anything here it would just be uh, maybe an index.html file and maybe an images just delete everything that you see here just um, tick everything and then delete selected then once you've done all that um, click upload files and what you want to do is I've already done it but what you're going to want to do is find that irc.html file on your computer which I did tell you to put in your desktop that's just ease of access and you're going to want to go yep upload it and I've already uploaded it so you just you would click upload and then you're pretty much done then once that's done just go return back to main menu and click on your domains well, the domain you're using, and yeah, once you go there, um, this is my website. Once you go there, just um, type in at the end of your um, domain irc.html. irc.html, and it, down the bottom, if you're using Firefox or something, you'll see it's connecting to Wild Ride. Wild Ride. Um, now I can log in. Um, I'll just use test login as a test. Um, now you'll see that you're logging into your chat. 
yep, blah blah blah. Um, just talk, yep, yep, yep. And then, hi guys, this is bro. Yep, this is just me, um, logging into the Duncan chat. And yes, now you want to remember this website URL. Now just copy it, then keep it in your clipboard or whatever you call it. Just keep it copied. Now what you're going to want to do is go to file and double click on the exit. Sorry, sorry people, I didn't tell you anything, did I? Um, sorry about that. You're going to want to um, go to <coughs> Visual Basic 2008, make a new form, um, get a web browser uh, and put that in there and then get a menu strip. Um, in the file I've got exit and I've just got a connect thing, like a plain connect thing. Just go into the file, click it, double click exit a bit and just type um, end. Then go double click on the connect and this is something I've already shown you but it's, you know, if you, either way you do it, I'm not really sure. Now you, what I'm going to want to do is make a link straight to this page that you just saw just to this page okay so we're gonna do web browser one dot navigate um, open parentheses then we call, um, quotation mark and you're gonna want to paste that website URL then you want to you know um, quotation marks and then close parentheses click enter or I click enter and then you're done it, it looked pretty simple but making a IRC chat isn't that easy and um, sometimes registering um, for a domain isn't that easy either now you're going to want to start debugging it and start playing on your little IRC you just made and once it loaded everything and it's ready to be tested um, you'll notice that this doesn't look that dissimilar to mine and once we click connect um, you'll see that it takes us straight to this page here but in this and sorry my computer yep and you'll see it here um, now we just connect with um, login. test login and you'll see it's connecting and in this window a new person will have just joined the test under um, chat and his name is blah 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 uh, test login 2 now I can just talk say hi and then it'll come up in this window um, I hope this helped you please comment rate subscribe um, send me a message if it didn't help you and thanks again